Hey everyone, welcome back. My name is Akib and in this video, I would like to share with you an amazing automation which will let you automatically send RSS feeds from a website to your community on Discord channel. Yes guys, suppose that you are running an e-magazine or a website or you are any news agency and you have a website and you are posting a blog post in the form of RSS feeds. Okay. So, and you are also managing your community on Discord server. Okay. So you want to share the updates of RSS feeds they are posting on your website with your Discord community as well. So here, this automation is going to help you a lot in this. Let me show you how. So this will be the flow of automation here as in when you, uh, a new post is posted on the website. Uh, the same RSS feed is going to be delivered on your Discord channel automatically. So you need not to manually uh, copy the link of the feed and then manually type a message here inside it on Discord channel. This is going to happen automatically and it will surely save a huge amount of time and energy of yours and it will improve your customer or user engagement as well. All right. And to make this happen, we are using Pabli Connect, which is an integration and automation tool. And guys, the best part of setting up this automation is that you will not require any coding skills or programming knowledge. So anyone can set up this automation very easily. So now let's set up this automation together. So the first step to set up this automation is to log in into your Pavli Connect account and reach the dashboard of Pavli Connect. And for this, you can check the link that we have pasted in the description for you from where you can set up your free Pavli Connect account in just two minutes and it will give you 100 free automation tasks for every new month. After setting up your account, you can log in and reach the dashboard and here you have to create a workflow. So to create a workflow, just click here on this create workflow button and here you can give any suitable name to your workflow. So I'm giving the name as uh, send RSS feeds on discord automatically. All right. So you can give the name according to you. All right. Now you can click here on this create button and you can see your workflow getting created on this page like this. And here you will find the trigger and the action, which is the basic building block of this automation. And the trigger is the happening of the event, which is going to trigger or start this workflow. And the action would be the response towards the trigger. As in our use case, the trigger would be a new feed uploaded on your website. And the action would be to send the same feed RSS feed on discord community as well. All right. So first of all, you have to set up this trigger. So from this choose a field, choose RSS feature by Pavli. All right. And in the trigger event, select new item in feed and then click on connect. And here it is asking for the feed URL. So here you can give any URL in this uh, uh, feed URL field of any RSS websites that you are uh, having or from any website. So I have opened this website of NDTV and here is the RSS feed section of this website. And here, let's say I want to uh, send the RSS feeds of uh, sports to my community that I'm uh, having on discord. All right. So I have opened uh, sports RSS feed and here I'm going to copy the link of this page by clicking on, uh, by copying this, uh, selecting this URL. I am copying this and I'm pasting this uh, URL here in this feed URL section like this. All right, then click on save and send test request and it will fetch the uh, details of a most recently uh, posted RSS feed like this. All right, so it is showing here uh, and the content, the link of the feed is this. Let me open this feed for you. This is the RSS feed captured by Pabli Connect. South Africa versus Bangladesh first test day five. All right. And uh, we have the details here. Now I, I want to send the same feed to my community here on Discord here. All right. So to make this happen, you have to connect Discord here in the section step search for discord and the action event would be select uh, send channel message with html all right then click on connect and now it is asking for the webhook url so you have to uh, get a webhook url from uh, discord by following these steps written here you can click on this text to find, uh, get these steps 
to create a URL inside Discord, let me show you how you can do this. So this is my Discord server and he here I have this general text channel. So in this general text channel, I want to send the RSS feeds. So from here only I want, I am going to click on this edit channel icon. And here I'm going to click on the integrations icon and under integrations, you will find this webhooks option. So click on view webhooks and under this, you can create a new webhook by clicking on new webhook button. All right. And here you have to give a name to this webhook. So I'm giving the name as RSS feeds. All right. Then click on save changes and then click on copy webhook URL and paste this URL here in this field like this and here you can type a message for your team so i'm uh, typing the message here as uh, sorry not team for audience so i am writing hi family we have uh we have got and we have just published a new RSS feed for you so you can uh, type the message accordingly according to yourself so here I'm just uh, type this kind of message and here after you I'm going to paste the link of the RSS feed which you will find here from this RSS step alright so when you click here you will find this RSS step in the drop down and from here only you can get the link which you can map it here like this alright so we have mapped the link. Now you can give the name to the bot who is delivering your message. So I'm giving the name as RSS bot, let's say. And here you can give the bots icon. You can uh, make the text to speech thing enable and the bot will read out the message aloud for you, for your family, for your audience. So here I'm, I'm making it disable for now. And guys, uh, this RSS feature by Pabli is going to work every eight hours it is you can read here it it is going to check in every eight hours if a new rss post got published on web the website or not and if there is any new rss post the same post is the same new post is going to be delivered like this on your discord server all right so you can check your connection with discord by clicking on save and send test request and a new message will be delivered here in this text channel here let me show you I'm clicking on save and send test request and let's see what happens. And we got a new message here. You can see this is the message and this is the RSS feed attached to this message and directly from here, your audience can see the feed and read the thing. And this is the same feed which I have attached here, which we got here in this website. All right. So this is how it is going to work in real time. And we are done setting up this automation. So first of all, I connected I use RSS by Pavli feature to get to fetch the feeds from any website by putting the uh, RSS link here. All right. After that, I connected Discord server in the action step with the help of this URL and type the message for my audience. All right. And you can uh, uh, use the same workflow guys, because I'm going to paste the link of the same workflow in the description so that you can clone it in your own free Pavli connect account. And guys, uh, you have to set up this automation only once after that you don't have to do anything manually after that this workflow is going to check in every eight hours if there is a new post on the website and if there will be it is going to be delivered on discord server and guys you can use this same workflow and you can run this automation instantly guys thank you so much for watching our video and please please let us know how our automation ideas are helping you in the comment section and if you have any queries related to this application, please ask your queries from this forum link and do check the pricing of this application from this link. And guys, we are open to ideas. If you want us that we should make videos on other aspects of your business, please do let us know in the comment section. And if you like our work, please subscribe to our channel.